Hey guys, welcome to another episode of Guilty Pleasures and Memories, where I talk about a Guilty Pleasure song for the next 31 days, or a 31 day challenge, and I talk about the memories it gave me. Now, for day 19, I'm going to be talking about a Spice Girl song called Spice Up Your Life. Now, I was, I tried not to be a Spice, I was not that big of a Spice Girl fan to begin with, mostly because my sisters and my mom like, were flat out kind of obsessed about them when I was a little kid, when they were at their height of their popularity. They always hogged the TV just because the Spice, Girl, the Spice Girls were, like, there was something about Spice Girls going on. Like, either there was the movie or a performance. At one point, we had a VHS tape of the behind-the-scenes thing, uh, behind-the-scenes uh, thing, or, like, behind-the-music thing, and a concert. A pretty much a concert, and my sister would play that constantly. I'm like, oh god, would you stop? And uh, it's, I'm like, I hate the Spice Girls because they're pretty much overexposed and they're ruining my TV time. Uh, so, uh, yeah, but this specific song for some reason just gets to me for some reason. And uh, the memories it gave me were most pretty much like a few years ago when I decided, you know, I'm just going to listen to some Spice Girls because I need some spice in my life and uh it was just like la 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 I'm like oh my god I love this song but I don't want my sisters to know because if they do they're going to be playing that song and they're just going to remind me my sisters have a lot of mention on this on this specific video challenge holy crap but I do not want them to know I don't want them to know about this specific song because it's going to it's going to ruin me like uh I do. I heard a lot of Spice Girl songs. Again, my sisters and my mom. But uh, I, again, more of a Backstreet Boys guy. Uh, but yeah, this specific song is like, yeah, I want to listen to this song. All over the world, spice up your life, every boy and every girl, spice up your life. Oh my God, it reminds me of the drag show or the drag club I went to when I was in Toronto with a few friends. And I'm like, oh my God, because they were like at the drag show. Or the drag club, the drag club I meant, was in the is in the gays district. I forgot what the the show was called, but it was right along the lines of a bookstore named Glad Day, the Glad Day bookstore, which I totally like, and I do want to bring a very special friend, um, a very close friend, a very cute friend to that bookstore, and I want to show them like books there that you don't really get anywhere, like at Indigo. Or the library. I just want to show him. Where, yeah, but along the bookstore uh, was is a drag club where uh, for the last two times I was there, they were playing '90s music. Like they were playing Alanis Morissette, they were playing Backstreet Boys, and at one point they were playing Spice Girls. And I'm like, oh my god! And we then we were we were there with a few friends. I'm like, oh fuck yes! And they were playing like Spice Girls. I'm like. I like. Just, I didn't know the lyrics, but I'm like, yeah, I'm just gonna like dance like no one's watching. <laughs> like the drag, there was a drag show on the stage, but I was just so busy with like the music, like I was so into the music. I'm like, yes, I'm like, yes, this is awesome. I'm like having such a good time. Like this was like last year, and I'm like, yeah, this is awesome. All over the world, spice up your life, and I'm like dancing and just like dancing with a few guys, dancing with a few girls. Okay, dancing with one guy, dancing with one girl, but you know how I am. It was it was pretty much like it was a gay district, and uh, it was fun. And, like that that song just brings out some sort of positivity to me if I end up being like comfortable with dancing with a few girls and guys, like uh like. I can't dance for shit. I can say that out loud. I can say for certainty that I can't dance for shit. But I actually had a good time moving around my body, you know, because the song was on, on and I'm like, okay, my sisters aren't around. I'm just going to, like, shimmy, shimmy, shimmy. Nobody says shimmy, does he? Nobody says shimmy, does he? Shimmy, 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 shimmy. <laughs> God, <laughs> but um, sorry, I made my, myself laugh. Oh God, um, <laughs> oh God. So anyway, the song just brings back some sort of bright light, like 
Anytime I just need to dance, not out of frustration, but just for something positive, I just go like, okay, this one specific Spice Girl song, let's do this all over the world. Spice up your life, every boy and every girl. Spice up your life, even in the world. Spice up your life. Uh... <laughs> I'm sorry. It's just that the song just reminds me. Ooh, I'm sorry if I'm kind of manic right now. It's just that I've been doing several epi straight episodes of this. I've shot a few videos, like a couple of albums and memories videos, and a couple of music video show episodes, and I'm just. Oh God, this is just all. I'm just all over the place right now. <laughs> so um. Yeah, but it's just, sorry, the the song is just bringing back memories of the drag club, and it's just pumping me up. It just pumps me up a lot. And, uh, geez, I should probably, you know, no, no nothing, never mind. I'm, yeah, just never mind. Um, yeah, it's actually just a fun song, just a fun, innocent song, which I used to not like because it was so overexposed. The Spice Girls were so overexposed, and I just hated everything about the Spice Girls. Now I don't. I, uh, you know, nostalgic. You know, nostalgic just comes back and bites you right in the ass. And the people who like the Spice Girls really like them, and the people who don't are like, I'm indifferent to. Ah, uh, shit. I have no choice, but the music, it's doing something to me. And yeah, that's pretty much how, I'm pretty much in that second count. Except, you know, I didn't want. Like, it took me years, but you know what? Fine. It took me a few years to get into the song. I don't really like the Spice Girls all that much still, but that specific song just gets to me the right way. And so that's another episode of Guilty Pleasures and Memories, and I will see you another time. Thank you.